Hi everybody, I'd like to show you how to configure VRRP Active or Standby. First, let's see the VRRP application scenario. VRRP groups multiple routing devices into a virtual router to implement gateway backup and ensure reliable communication. In the figure to the right, switch A and switch B constitute a VRRP group. Normally, switch A is the master and forwards service packets. Switch B is the backup and does not forward services. When switch A fails, switch B becomes the new master and continues to forward data to implement gateway backup. Let's move on to the configuration roadmap. First, assign an IP address to each interface and configure a routing protocol to ensure network connectivity. Second, configure a VRRP group between switch A and switch B. Third, configure a higher priority for switch A so that switch A functions as the master to forward traffic and set the preemption delay to 20 seconds. Let's see the configuration procedure for VRRP. Before configuring VRRP, configure devices to ensure network connectivity. The configuration procedure is not provided here. Configure VRRP group 1 and virtual IP address on switch A. Set the priority for switch A in VRRP group 1 to 120. Set the preemption delay of switch A to 20 seconds. Configure VRRP group 1 and a virtual IP address on switch B. Configure switch B to use the default priority of 100. Now, let's show you how to configure VRRP on the device. Configure switch A. Enter the interface view. Configure VRRP group 1 and a virtual IP address on switch A. Set the priority of switch A in VRRP group 1 to 120. Set the preemption delay of switch A to 20 seconds. Configure switch B. Enter the interface view. Configure VRRP Group 1 and a virtual IP address on switch B. Configure switch B to use the default priority of 100. And that's all. Good luck, folks. To obtain more information about common configurations and typical features of Huawei switches, see the All About Switches threads. Where do you find these threads? Using Google search, type in all about switches site colon Huawei.com in the search field and click any of the displayed links to enter the Huawei Enterprise Support Community. For details about more features, visit the homepage. The All About Switches threads describes typical configurations and users' questions about Huawei switches. Well, that's all for today. Thanks for listening, and goodbye.